it's the sole responsibility of the canine handler for the well-being of that of the, the animal that that we're traveling with and nothing substitutes going out and physically checking on that dog um, however because sometimes investigations arrest times things of that such the job being so dynamic we never know what we're doing and where we're at his time in the vehicle may become an extended amount of time 30 40 minutes uh, before we can get back and check on them. So the system that we have in play today is actually a thermostat system that will help help us keep track of the temperature inside the car, especially on hot days. Uh, what we have is a thermostat that has two temperatures on it, one at 87 degrees, one at 93. If at any time the, uh, the air conditioning system that just comes equipped with this vehicle if at any time anything fails and the temperature inside the vehicle meets or exceeds 87 degrees, the vehicle would sound uh, similar to a car alarm. We've all heard a car alarm go off. The horn will begin to sound. The windows will roll down and we have installed an exhaust fan on one of the, uh, the kennel windows that will help draw hot air out of the vehicle. Um, so actually it draws heat from this passenger side, which will suck cooler air inside, well, through the other open windows. We're listening for that horn. That horn will get our attention. If the AC system failed, we know that there's the windows are gonna go down. He's gonna be cool. Uh, well, it's, it's gonna prevent him from overheating. It's gonna give us time to get out there and get to him so that he can get out the car. And out.